nice magician to go in and take it and document them to make the most spectacular living fossil record the world's ever seen. Wait, wait, go in and document? What do you mean, like with people? Yes. The animals won't even know they're there. Very low impact, strictly observation and documentation. Our satellite infrareds show that the animals are fiercely territorial. The carnivores are isolated in the interior of the island so the team can stay on the outer rim. Don't worry, I'm not making the same mistakes again. No, you're making you're making all new ones. Uh, okay, so there's another island with dinosaurs, no fences this time, and you want to send people in, very few people, on the ground, right? And who are these four lunatics that you're, you're trying to con into this? Well, it was difficult to convince them as to what they were going to see, and in the end I had to use my checkbook to get them there. But uh, there's Nick Van Owen, who's a video documentarian, and Eddie Carr, who's a field equipment expert. Uh, we have our paleontologist, and I was hoping that perhaps you might be the fourth. No, no. We've been on the verge of Chapter 11 ever since that accident in the park, and there are those in the company who wanted to exploit Site B in order to bail us out. Well, they've been planning it for years, and I've been able to stop them up until now. But a few weeks ago, a British family on a yacht cruise stumbled across the island, and their wee girl was injured. Oh, she's fine, she's fine. But uh, the board has used the incident to take control of InGen from me. And now it's only a matter of time before this lost world is found and pillaged. Public opinion is the one thing that I can use to preserve it, but in order to rally that kind of support, I need a complete photo record of those animals alive and in their natural habitat. So you went from capitalist to naturalist in just four years. That's, that's something. It's our last chance at redemption. John. the other three members of your team, and I'm going to stop them uh, from going. Who's the paleontologist, by the way? Who did you say? She, she came to me. I want you to know this. Who did? Leave it to you, Ian, to have associations, affiliations, even liaisons with the best people in so many fields. You didn't contact Sarah. Paleontological behavior study is a brand new field, and Sarah Harding is on that frontier. No. Her theories on parenting and nurturing amongst carnivores has framed the debate. What are you doing? Where, where's your phone? It's too late. She's already there. The others are meeting her in three days. You sent my girlfriend to this island alone? Sent is hardly the word. She couldn't be restrained. She was already working in San Diego doing some research at the Animal Park. And it's only a couple of hours' flight from there. And she was adamant, absolutely adamant about New York, about making the initial folly by herself. <laughs> Think she's dying out of fossil observation without interference, she said. And she went on and on. Well, you know how it is. After you were injured in the park, she sought you out. And then she went all the way down to that hospital in Costa Rica to ask somebody who she didn't even know whether the rumors were true. Oh, if you want to leave your name on something, fine. But stop putting it on other people's headstones. Oh, just... oh, oh, come on, she'll be fine. She spent years studying African predators, you know, sleeping downwind and all. She knows what she's doing. And believe me, the research team will... It's not a research expedition anymore. It's a rescue operation. Let's leave them right now.